Hi friends! Wearing my mask from the SE. Nice little red, this is the way. I'm excited to watch a new episode that just came out, the season finale. Yeah, I'm excited. Oh, I'm having a day, and I hope this weekend turns out better, which I'm sure it will. I'm not too worried about it. Well, I'm my life's not horrible. I'm just getting really irritated. I've been coming up with this theory on Fridays. People are always actually really anxiety, want to get done with the week, just and they're very impatient, very antsy. Like this morning, I was at the gas station and I was getting checked out. Register goes down. And he says, I'll help you over here. So we start moving over there. Seven people skip me. I'm just like, what the fuck? And I have to wait for all these people to get checked out. It's just like, people being extra. And literally, it's just, I didn't want to talk about it. But I literally just had a lady see me waiting for a fucking parking spot and swoops in and takes it. I'm just like, I, I just don't get it no more. This is just, the world is so tiring. Like, and I was talking to a buddy about this whole gas station thing. It's like, just because you're younger, people think they're they're more granted and privileged to it just because they're older. Yeah, I get the whole seniority act on this. But no, it's who the hell makes you better than me just because you're older? Like, just because you have age on me doesn't mean shit, man. I could be a hell of a lot smarter than you and you had twice the time to learn. And it's just like, ah. Uh, like I get why <laughs> some of the older people like talking to me and I'm kind of excited to teach this older guy uh, how to use his first ever smartphone and uh, yeah I don't know but on that I know a few other things I've been thinking about and this like whole like catfishing thing if like if you got to make a fake profile and you want to snoop around in somebody's life why are you what are you doing with your life? Like, come on. Like, people, you're weird. People are weird. And people call me crazy and weird. It's just like, do you see the shit you do? Do you see the shit that you've done? Why, why, why are you putting your head about yourself out on me? Because you're obviously talking about yourself, but you can't come to the realization you're fucking weird. But I'm not calling everybody weird. Goon Squad, we're all different. Anyway, like people, be proud of who you are. Be proud of who you like yourself. Don't even steal people's photos and try to act like doing it. Get people to talk to you. Social engineering. Be more open. Be more confident. Because I bet you half the people that are scared to talk to people, they the person probably would talk to them if they weren't fucking weird. Come on, learn how to talk. I'm. This is how we get people not to talk to me. It's to by being weird. And like the people that deal with me in like daily life know that this whole like thing on social media is kind of like more of an act because look what I'm trying to do music, entertainment. Like people don't get it, they're just like, ah, he's fucking weird. No, I, I talk about shit that's not even going on in my life that somebody might have going on that might relate to somebody else. And I just, I put my shoes, put, put that person's story in my shoes and I explain it through that way. You know, I got some difficulties when I, you know, I'll get sad about things, but certain people come back around. It's just like, I don't know if I should trust you anymore. Like, what's your attention to coming back around? Are you here just trying to fuck with me or what? And I just, I don't get it anymore. It makes me paranoid and makes me freak out. You know, I'm, I'm realizing I don't need to be pissed off at such a small thing sometimes. I need to be more appreciative and not let the small things bother me because small things always bother me and it gets to me and I'm sure I'm not the only person this happens to and I need to brush it off more and not worry about it I need to grow like this morning I should have brushed off like all these incidents of these people feeling privileged because they're old and they're rude it's, kind of, it's called being rude but I'm brushing it off because you know what I probably will never see any of those people ever again. So why should I care? Exactly, I shouldn't care. I just want everybody to know that you're beautiful. 
I love turtles. And you, uh, you stay peaceful and positive and stay safe. Like, everybody's handling this differently. So, and you know, this holiday season, some of us are, this pandemic's bringing us down because we can't do certain things that we normally do. Well, create the new norms. Create a new way of celebrating Christmas because who knows, you might end up celebrating it like this next year. So, I don't know. Remember, if you see someone you don't necessarily like, treat them with kindness. Treat them with respect. And I had to do this today. And I got called a good person. Because they knew it, bother the, it bothers the hell of me, but I'm just generally a kind person. And I treat, try to treat everybody how I want to be treated. And sometimes, you know, it's hard because some people are just... Oh my god, why are you telling me this? And I hear sometimes stories like like the fourth time, and I'm sure sometimes I tell stories four times. But man, wow. It's just like, I'm not a nice person, it's just who I am. It's what I want to do. It's how I want to respond. I don't want to be that fucking big asshole anymore. So you know, I, I know I can be better. I know I can be better. I know I can do better because it kind of encouraged me to the words I've gotten from other people that wow Billy you've, you, you, you fixed some, some shit that you fucked up and it's good and you know like you get to a certain set of standards of good then you keep finding things that you can work on so your whole new good is on a different level and on a different goal of now I have to do better I'm in a good position but then you see flaws and you want to even do it even better than that. And that's the struggle of it all. And yeah. But that's the best part. You always don't think you're good and you keep striving and you keep pushing and you keep doing better. And I kind of fuck with that. That logo. Anyway. I'm gonna end this up because I got one more stop to make and we're closing here so I hope everybody has a, a happy Friday uh, go get a fish fry I suggest curbside take it home, relax, stay warm when it's cold but remember to stay peaceful try to keep your sanity as much as you can while you're getting uh, stir crazy it could get, could go back to being worse because you know it gets worse before it gets better and we haven't seen anything better so it's gonna get worse eventually so I hope everybody stays safe has a great weekend I might check in and make another one my goal is to make one every day for 30 days so here we go over and out stay strong